You could have lived anywhere in the country. You yeah. could have been on, you know, Fifth Avenue in New York City. Why did you decide to come to Montclair? I actually moved to Montclair, New Jersey the day I got back from my honeymoon. My husband and I fell in love with Montclair. We, know we, we knew we didn't want to be New York City uh, couple. We didn't, want to be, we didn't want to raise New York City kids. We really wanted a normal life. And I, no, I, nothing I liked better than to leave a fashion shoot and say goodbye to everybody while they're going out and I go through the Holland or the Lincoln Tunnel and I kind of decompress and then I go home and go to the park with my dog or my kid or whatever it was. And you elected to send your kids to public schools. I mean, we have a lot of fancy, expensive public schools. private schools. Yes, why wouldn't I? Why wouldn't I send my kids to public school? I did too. Right? I mean, why not? Our public schools are great. And, you know, when people come up to me and they say, oh, my God, you're so normal. Like, what does that mean? What am I supposed to be? So, you know, I've had some pretty amazing role models in my life. You know, other people that were well-known years before I was. Yogi Berra, for one. Yogi you know? Berra. How do you mention Montclair without Yogi? And you can't. Who was more beloved and more famous than this man? And more generous. And more he, generous. He, he, he was also in the parks and in the streets and right. at the fundraisers and always so dear and humble about it. After you built your cosmetics empire and moved on to the next chapter, you decided to rebuild Montclair. You guys are building, what's it, 18 Label? Sound eight, studio? Eight, no, 18 Label is a film and television studio. Right now, the Food Network, about two weeks a month shoot there, and it's rented out the other times. Across the street, we're building um, what is going to be 18 Label, the Annex. Two more studios, and I have an because office. Because there's so many television people there's in so this town. There's so many people, and yeah. and Food Network actually started shooting. It's actually BSTV, which is this great woman named Beth Burke. I met her at the Spinning Studio, and I told her about this studio we were opening. She came and saw it, and she started. She said, Look, "I want this," and she started filming the kitchen, and it's been there for a couple years now. And it's right behind the bread company. It is right behind, behind the bread company, which my husband is a landlord of that cool place. And, um, you know, I was working with Rachel from the bread company to work on the breakfast at the George. So the cool thing about Montclair, there's so many innovative entrepreneurs, and it's really fun. Very eclectic town. We're sitting in the George. Now, this was the Georgian Inn, which was beyond down on its luck. Yes, Poor dog that's a nice way. Thing. That's a nice way to say it. <laughs> that, yes. that nobody would ever. Right. Um, and you took it over and transformed it into this extraordinary place with with photos of Georges, of famous Georges everywhere. It, there are two. The the George Bush. Presidencies, the Bushes. I George don't see. Bush has a great picture in the in our bathroom, which oh, is good. a beautiful bathroom. It's a picture of George Bush um, the second with his dog, and it's a great picture. And George Bush Senior will have to find a place here. It's still a work in pro in process. There's there's room. There are room on oh, the yeah. walls. There's definitely room. But this is really spectacular. Oh, thank you. And, and all the whole town thanks you. It's about time. You know what? Um, we did not have a place for people to stay. And so a lot of we people... We didn't. There'll be a lot of mother-in-laws staying here, I, I have been told. <laughs> <laughs> Montclair has been called Brooklyn West or mm -hmm. the West West Side right. or the New West Side. or so. What do you call it? Well, when Vogue covered the George, I said um, that Montclair is the Brooklyn of New Jersey. It is. Because we are cool. Because we are cool. And we are open and we are eclectic and we could all live together even though we are not the same. Incredibly diverse. And we're, yes, exactly. And we all like each other. And, and going to the supermarket is a political experience it, because it, everyone's so active. Right. You know, there's so many interesting people in this town. You know, people that you've heard of and a zillion people you haven't heard of. You know, from, you know, from your hairdresser to, you know, your trainer to, you know, my dog walker that I see. Hi, Joey, every morning. So there's just these great people that, that live in this town that I've been friends with. And, um, you know, I couldn't imagine my life anywhere else. Bobby Brown, thank you for your time. Thank you for this great hotel. Thank you for having me.